If it's July, it must be Christmas or at least time for our annual Christmas in July challenge. Hello, everybody. I'm Kath Armstrong, creator of the Cheapskates Club, and this is day 28 of our annual Christmas in July challenge. We have a set gift budget, but often I find amazing gifts, truly amazing gifts, well under budget, and they're worth more than what we've budgeted and certainly more than what we've paid for them. For example, I found a tea for two set marked at $10 and the budgeted amount for that particular gift was $25. But when I checked online, I noticed that the retail would be $80 to buy that tea for two set. So that was a great bargain. I'm happy with that. And what I did was shift $15 from the gift budget, what was left of the budgeted amount for that gift, to our savings account. If you find a gift under budget that retails at or above your budgeted amount, great. You don't need to buy or make anything else to bring it up to budget. It's already there it's above budget just move the excess to your savings or your emergency fund and pat yourself on the back for being a savvy cheapskater and a savvy shopper and remember money isn't saved until it's safely in the bank until then it's just not spent if you know someone who might like our Christmas in July series or who might benefit from knowing about the Cheapskates Club, please use the share button to send them the link and I'll be back tomorrow with another great idea for Christmas in July brought to you by the Cheapskates Club.